माई डियर भिवार्स ओलकाम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल इलेक्ट्रिकल फैसनेट ए गाइड अफ इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजिनियरिंग टूडे आई सेल डिसकस अबाउट फिलिंग प्रसेस अफ एयर सेल इन कन्जार्भेटर अब ए ट्रांसफर्मार एज यूजुअल आई हाव एन एपिल टू माई निव भिवार्स प्लिज सबसक्राइब टू माई चैनल एंड प्रेस दि बेल आईकन नाउ प्लिज वाच फ्लेक्सिबल सेपारेटर और एयर सेल description flexible separators or air cell is fitted inside a cylindrical conservator while being outside the separator is in direct contact with atmosphere this type of mounting makes it possible to compensate for the oil volume displacement due to temperature variations construction The basic construction of the separator is a highly resistant fabric coated externally to resist transformer oil and internally to ozone and weather resistant. Why the flexible separator is used in a transformer? Necessity of air cell to avoid contact between air and oil. and consequently of condensation and oxidation inside the transformer to protect against water vapor and gases to suppress of any gas bubble formation in oil to compensate the large volume changes filling procedure of an air cell of a conservator a without vacuum in conservator b under vacuum in conservator A without vacuum in conservator keep air release valve open fix air filling adapter on breather pipe inflate the air cell at an air pressure indicated on the instruction plate affix on the transformer and hold air pressure do not apply excess air pressure as it may damage the air cell open air release valve and start oil filling from bottom of the conservator keep washing the release valve as soon as oil starts overflowing close the air release valve or plug one by one stop oil filling when all air release valves are closed remove air filling adapter continue oil filling and observe the magnetic oil level gauge molg stop oil filling when needle of the molg shows the level corresponding to the ambient temperature at the time of filling fix silica gel breather caution plain oil level indicator should indicate full oil level always do not open any air release valve after completion of oil filling if do so air will enter and oil level will drop if air enters the conservator it can be seen by a fall in oil level 
in plain oil level indicator or gauge. Filling of air cell under vacuum in conservator. The conservator with its separator being set off and plugged in the above transformer is connected to its oil filling reserve by a pipeline in its lower part. Proceed as follows. Create vacuum in separator. With the same source of vacuum, create a vacuum in the conservator. Open the oil filling valve of the transformer. Because of the vacuum in the conservator, the oil level rises automatically. Stop the oil filling once the required volume in the conservator is attended. While maintaining the conservator under vacuum, allow dry air or nitrogen gas to enter into the internal part of the separator. Then the separator inflates by itself and takes all the free space due to the fact that the conservator was not completely full. In particular, during the op operation, the oil is going to rise to the top of the conservator. Inflate the separator at a maximum as shown in the instruction plate. Check on the vent holes and confirm that there is no more air in the conservator or if necessary adjust the level. Thank you for watching this video.